Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Captain Dr. Spock, and today we are playing Gold Rush. It just popped up on the Steam store here very recently. We are going to get a new game started up here, and uh, yeah, I'm excited because I used to, well I still would if I didn't hurt so much, but I used to dig for gold like myself, not on large scale, but it, like got a little backpack sluice box and shovel and buckets and got my, my my pan and yeah man i used to dig gold so this this right here is awesome so i'll bring you guys back once we're loaded in and we'll get this show on the road okay so this is what we're greeted with although i'm not really looking for a guide i've played oh what no i've played a little bit Ooh. still a little buggy that's okay though i played a little bit before uh before this, kind of just enough to familiarize myself. So what we're gonna do is, there we go. Take the, that's uh, X to start. Spacebar to take the. <coughs> sorry about that. Spacebar to take the parking brake off. We're gonna roll right up here across the tracks to the. What is that called? Not a warehouse. Um, Mining supplies, I guess? The mining store. We're just going to call it the mining store. Here we go. Jump on out. So yeah, guys, down real quick down below, in the comments below, let me know what you think of this game, if you've seen it, if you haven't. What do you think of gold digging, mining, processing, all that fun stuff? Um, our first thing we're going to be doing here is gold mining tier one hog painting digging and hog painting um you can go through these yourself i mean we're just you know we're gonna get our hands on a hog pan this thing right here and get that all set up so uh with the two hundred dollars i got in my pocket let's go ahead and uh see there's two here there's the hog pan with a pump and the hog pan we're starting out with this one We're gonna get this. Oh. Wait, that's the extension. Hold off on the extension. Need two mats. Is that it? Do I even have enough for what I got? 50. Hog pan. Your stuff has been prepared. Ooh, ooh. Sorry if it's a little slippy and glitchy. Um, running, it's it's jumping right now between 17 and 20 frames, sadly. Um, it's still very early. Optimizations haven't haven't quite came yet, but here we go. Let's go ahead and pick up our newly acquired stuff. Drop tailgate. Put this up in there. Get all of our things and stuff here. And then we will be be ready to mine. Actually, we need to buy buckets with the last what? Two, forty bucks. We'll spend forty bucks on buckets. Get two buckets. Because, you know, buckets make, make... Don't show this again. Thank you. I know that you guys are going to make a stockpile for me. But yeah, get us some buckets. We'll go set this up. Uh, I'm gonna cut the drive out there just because it's a little. Oh, oh! I mega through the bucket. Whoopsie. I can't remember who it was, but one of my friends was asking me if you can throw in this game, and that answers that question. I tossed it right over the top of that truck. Oh, what are you doing? What? Oh, what? 
Well, I don't know what I just did there, but I think I'm lacking water and dirt to be doing any of that right now. Okay, there we go. We could, uh... Well, no, I can't think of anything else I need right now, so... From here, I will meet you guys back at the claim. Oh, wait, no, I can't go to the claim yet. That's right, I need to first get permission. So, we're gonna go ahead and pull out of here. And roll our happy selves right on over here to the bank! Oh, double tap. It should turn off and off. Oh yeah, that's that was a lot of on and off for that poor thing. So now that we're here at the bank, we can. Where's the rent price? Price. His rent claim. Well, just click the rent button. Obviously, no money was taken or anything that was... Ooh, look at the price. It it's almost looks like it's on the climb right now. Um, I don't have any gold bars to sell. Uh, it does look like I came with some gold, so we can honestly... I'm just going to show this off, too. We could make some gold monies right off the bat here. If we go to the other end of town. So now I've got my first spot rented. Ooh. Remember, slow down for them railroad tracks, people. Yeah, loading. So that's one thing about this game is the... Oh, the loading, uh... Loading screens, and then also for some reason, specifically for me, over here is real rough, so... I don't know if you guys really want to see this horrible glitchiness. Um, it, don't worry, this will be the only time I bring you guys here. But the only reason I... and it seems like when I'm only when I'm in the truck. Um, I take that back. I don't know. There's something over here. Memory leak or something. But anyway, you come up to this guy. This is a blacksmith. We can take that little bit of gold we have. Here we go. Whoops. Yeah. Take that little bit of gold we have and sell it for... Oh, only 34 bucks? Really? No way. Yeah. Wow. Never mind. I take that back. Just ignore me. Okay, so... Now that I failed at that, that's okay. We will... Go to our first parcel. Um, which, you know, if we... That's the mining shop. We just come down this dirt road here. I was going to turn there, but never mind. Decisions were made for me there. And honestly, once you get where you're going, it runs real smooth. It's just driving from place to place. It's a little... A little jumpy and laggy. But other than that, it's really not that bad. Very enjoyable. I was watching my buddy Chevy play play this yesterday, and he was finding all sorts of things and stuff. Um, we'll go over that later, though. Getting a little... Getting a little loose there. Surprised I haven't lost anything out the back. So, here we go. Coming up on our... Our first mining spot. Oh! Old... Old Arnold parcel. Looks like we can park stuff there. Oop. Yeah. Very nice. This looks like pretty much the same spot that everybody starts out at. 
that you've seen many, many times. A little storage unit spot. <clears throat> little tent. one day we'll be making the monies. Making the monies. Okay, okay. So, I just skipped the whole process of me unloading the truck because, well, who wants to watch that? But we're going to take our, our sluice here, set up on them sticks, which the first time I went through this I was so confused. I didn't know where to put that up at. It wouldn't let me put it up anywhere. Take our hogwash plant, put it on top of that, Take our mats, lay them down inside to catch the sweet, sweet gold that's about to fall from there. We're going to have to have a bucket with us over here. Water. The miner's best friend. And let's take our bucket right there. This bucket... We'll just leave right there for now. And... Okay, so, now that we have this all set up, a bucket of water... We hit, well, I've, I've actually changed mine to 2 and 3 to be able to switch through the different things, but it used to be the semicolon, or sorry, comma and period to switch tools. There we go, yeah, tools. Hands to tools. And you come over here, and this little patch of nonsense right here is, you guessed it, sweet, sweet dirt. And you take the blah, 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 cat hair blah, out of your mouth, and then you keep shoveling dirt into this thing, and you see how it starts to fill it up. And you just dump a do. And honestly, I'm gonna dig this thing right along the edge here, while always following the. Okay, so, there you go, see, we have, there's obviously four mats to be able, we don't have the ability to put the other two down, but we have these two. There's a hundred percent material in the box, let's go back to our hands, grab our bucket of water, oops, it's gonna take a couple, couple runs of water, but, as you see, we can see little spots of gold running down through, and I know it may seem like we might be losing some, and I guess, you know, technically, maybe we could be, but... This is what I'm going to be doing for the next, I don't know, probably five... Five minutes or so, I and mean, as you see, one... Oh, I don't think there was actually any in there that time. Okay, so... That's the process. We fill it up. It gives us about 4%. Come back. Whoop. Get our shovel out again. And get to... Get to filling. Just like this. Now, I sadly... In, like, I wish I had something this like this. I only have the bottom half. I would only have this right here. Like, this mat length of a sluice buck. It fits inside of my backpack. It's actually one of the cutest little sluice boxes I've ever seen. But, don't get it wrong. It will find gold. And it finds gold. Oop, there we go. So yeah, I'm gonna do this till I get the these up to 100, and I'll bring you guys back once I do. I'll see you guys in just a minute. Uh, just digging away. Figured I'd bring you guys in to show you the hole I've made. Um, I do have to say, this is one of my favorite digging mechanics in a game I've ever seen so far. How the land deforms as you dig. Sadly, it's only, you know, certain chunks, but it's still pretty cool. I can't lie. Come here, Bucket. There we go. Bucket's got water. Yeah. Figured I'd bring you guys back to show you the progress made. We're at 36% or so, and that's how much we've dug up. Um, so, you know, it obviously holds quite a bit of dirt. 
yeah, I will, whoops, I will keep on digging away for you guys and bring you back once I got this all back up to 100. There's another really nice thing I noticed about this. Uh, yeah, by having mined before, as I'm digging through this amazing sweet dirt, I want to know the one thing I haven't hit yet? A giant rock that's stopped my progress. Besides, I guess, you know, the, the, the ground. But it's just a barrier in the game. I haven't once had to use a crowbar to get at these, at the dirt. It's just, it's amazing. It's very, very amazing. Um, this game does make mining very relaxed and comfortable, whereas mining in real life is hard and just dirty, hard work. But it's so worth it. Oh, I love it. I love it. Can't get enough of that stuff. Sorry if I sound like I was a little far away there. I was leaning back. Um, what are we at? 47. We're halfway there almost, so... We're getting there. Takes a little bit of time to get this done, but it is totally worth it. And once we, you know... Once we... I want to say once we pan... Once we pan this out, and maybe one or two more, we should have enough to get our hands on a, a water pump, a pump sluice, and the hoses needed to uh, run all that stuff so that we don't have to feed it water. We just we feed it the good stuff. The water's taken care of. It makes my it makes it a lot all all so much faster because then we're not stopping the dig to give it water like we are now. But yeah, I will. Uh, there we go. There's 50 percent. So I'll bring you guys back in just a little bit. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. I'll bring you guys back in a little bit, though. Well, looks like I might not be able to get it to 100 before darkness. So I'm gonna do my best to get as much as I can before absolute darkness hits. And then once darkness hits, we'll move this operation into the tent where it's still got some light. Come on now, shovel. Just so we're not standing around in the dark because, well, who likes to stand in the dark, right? In fact, this will this will be the last last load of dirt we do. Ooh. Yeah, this will be the last load of dirt we do. Then we'll we'll move all of our operation inside here. Okay, so we washed it out. I'm gonna click the headlamp on. We got up to 67%. So, take our bucket, fill it with water. We're gonna take our other bucket now and fill it with water. Take our mat, dunk, 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 dunk. Do you see how dirty that water got? Try it one more time? No, okay. So yeah, we're gonna, I, I don't know why, I've all seen other YouTubers only dunk it once and then go. It's all about washing that thing, man. It only takes more than one wash. See, it makes the water one color. Makes the water another color. Makes that water real dirty. And then we know that that's clean. We put it back in there. We take our buckets. And we're gonna come in here with them. I'm gonna put this right here for now. Grab up our other bucket. here and let's dump that right there um, put that down there now where's I like to turn this so that it's facing like that because it kind of does depend because the pan 
Oh. Hold on. We're jumping the gun. So this is our pan, this is our, our pan and bucket, and our, our pan and bucket needs the water. So we come down here, scoop up some aqua. There we go, now we're, uh, now we're cooking with oil. Okay, so, like I said, I like to turn the pan and bucket like that. Take my dirt. Here we go. Left click, right click, lowers it, raises it. Lower, get some water. Shake it up, shake it up. Get the wash going. Shake it up again. Okay. Start pouring some of that water off. Bring it back towards me. That's a nice nugget right there. Yes, oh yes, oh yes. Come here. There we go, those were... Those are some nice starting eggs. Wolves are going crazy right now. Pour the rest of this off. I technically should have poured that into the bucket. Just because, you know, you never know there could have been gold, but... Get our next spot of dirt in the pan. Repeat process. Rinse and rinse. Rinse and rinse. Tip it forward. Oh, yes. Oh, ooh. That was a nice one. I've never had to use the tweezers before. Just to make sure. Oh, look at that. You can dump them out, but you can l technically lose them out the side. Ooh, what are you doing? Dump that water out. That was a nice one. I've never had to use the tweezers before. Let's get another, another scoop in there. And mind you, this is still only one of two buckets. There's still another bucket of pay dirt to go through. There we go. Rinse it up. Wash them out. Got here. Another one for the tweezers. Oh, wow. This is awesome. This is some nice gold. This is bigger gold than I found the first time I played. When I was just testing this stuff out. This is awesome. Let's see what else we got. And I think that... Yeah, okay. So it's about... Three to four dumps per a bucket. There we go. Washed off. Dump out the, the extra water. Yeah. Very nice. Yep, that's everything. Dump that out. Sweet birdie up to 0.226 ounces of gold. The next bucket, what does it bring us? Gotta make sure we're at least trying to dunk it in the water. Animals are going crazy out there. This is Alaska, I guess, but damn. Okay. There's another ten. Ooh, another... Oh! Tweezers, I love you. You make finding the gold so much more exciting. Yeah, I wasn't finding gold that big the first time. Let's go ahead and dump that there. And mind you, this was only 
what was it, 60 something percent? This wasn't even a full load for the, the sluice box. I bet these are tweezers. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a nice big nug right there. Now that was... That was beautiful. Oh, wait. Jumping the gun. I think we got one more... One more dump here. But yeah, guys. Let me know what you think of this so far. I mean, I'm enjoying myself. I love digging for gold, so... If you guys want to see more of this, hit that like button. Let me know. Right down in the comments below. Let me know what you think. I'm enjoying myself. I mean... I, I plan on bringing more of this, so it's... it's you know. Oh! It's in the works. Nice there, so... Oh, man. 0.4 ounces. 0.4 that's amazing. I love that. I love it. Dump that out. Oh, we have one more. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go ahead and get this going. Yes. Dump off the extra water. Both of those nugs look like they are... Oh no, never mind. I was about to say going to be tweezer nugs, but I guess not. Okay, that had to have been the last, the last bucket full. That was... Okay, I want to thank you guys very much for joining me on my first day of digging for gold in Gold Rush the game. We got .46 ounces. That is awesome. That's the first time I've had to use the tweezers, um, but it's, it was just great. And again, look at how pretty this game is. That's one thing that I really like about this. Yes, we got two flashlights. We got a headlamp and a hand flashlight. But yeah. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below in this little trailer thing if we really wanted. Ooh. Hands? Yeah, there we go. Use. We could go to sleep and go to dawn go an hour. We're just going to go back because, well, I'm not done talking to you guys. I'm not ready to go to sleep yet. Maybe it's not the best to go out here. But anyway, like I said, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. I'm enjoying myself. I plan on bringing more of this to the, to the channel, so if you guys enjoy it, then that just makes it all the more more want for me to do this but leave a like subscribe if you haven't and leave a comment let me know what you think but until then i'm captain dr spock this is gold rush the game and i am signing out